Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this 2010 Mercedes E250 CGI. Being a CGI it makes it a turbo petrol and it is a four cylinder. It's an AMG pack so it's got the AMG pack wheels and body kit. It also has the AMG mats. And this car even has the leather bucket style seats with Airmatic. It's got memory electric seats on the drivers and passenger side. It has the nice big panoramic sunroof. It's got the original two keys. Um, Harman Kardon sound system which is nice. Reverse camera, navigation, Bluetooth, climate control. We'll start it up. It starts nice and quietly, very smooth. It's been serviced very well. It's only done 55,000 kilometers, and the last service was a major one, which is good. So you can see here you got Bluetooth, reverse camera, navigation the interior and exterior in particularly good condition that red lights just a sign I need to put my seatbelt on it's just a nice clean example it's got the uh, larger European star number plates which are about $450 when you order them the seatbelts come out to you just here as you can see so it certainly makes it a lot easier as opposed to grabbing all the way back here trying to get your seatbelt which was first seen on the uh, Mercedes-Benz W124 it's a four seater um, it's silver obviously with black leather interior so it's nice and easy to keep clean uh, the driver's seat is excellent I guess what's good about this car, it's low kilometres, but it's also in particularly good condition. Some of these low kilometre cars, you may think are in good condition, but it's only done low kilometres, it's sat in traffic, you know, for an hour every day on the way to work, and it's a short distance. But there's been a lot of getting in and out of the car, bumper bumper driving, but um, certainly does not look like one of those vehicles. But every panel, all the lights, the wheels, the tyres are all in fantastic condition. I think it's incredible value for money when you consider this would have been about $120,000 when it was new. And now you can buy it for somewhere around $30,000 or just over with just 55,000 kilometres. I find even these cars with 150,000 kilometres, you know, they're still asking very decent money for those. But it's certainly a very impressive car, very well cared for. It's got some very good options. Um, and just to name them again, airmatic seats, panoramic roof, Harman Kardon sound system, Xenon lights, obviously, reverse camera, AMG pack. Um, so the AMG pack came with these wheels. So you can see it's got a bit of a body kit, front and rear parking sensors, daytime running lights. And quite a few of these cars have had the wheels put on them, but they're not the AMG. You can basically tell by the front bar, the side skirt, and on the back, you can tell because there's a black, that back insert and the back uh, bumper bar there. So that's, that's how you can tell if it really is a proper AMG, because a lot of them are not. It also has a cross-drilled, ventilated, front brakes well it's a very impressive car I don't think it's going to last long with these kilometres in this condition in an AMG pack and uh, certainly be more than happy to answer any questions you might have about this vehicle uh, we're located close to Sydney airport we've been doing this for over 20 years we specialise in European cars mostly Mercedes Benz we can help you with finance and uh, we certainly look forward to speaking to you soon about this vehicle 
Thanks for watching.